Alright people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Monday, we are playing with the Nordics. Uh, we're gonna try the, the Draco Pal Nordics now. Uh, <laughs> cause I was like, you know what, screw it, let's go ahead and try out this version. Uh, I, of course we're gonna probably be, uh, for poor health card is activated, you know, they're gonna try to pop junk, alright. Uh, there's gonna probably be a point where I'm gonna be like, you know what, this isn't even Nordics anymore, but I was like, you know what, I was like, let me see if I can get a little bit more pendulum based, you know, see if there's anything there when it comes to that. And, uh, we might be able to be able to play? I don't know. I don't know. I know you're a tuner. So I can sink you with some fours. I have... I don't have enough fours. I don't have enough fours. Hold on. Okay. So... Like I said, I could put this in a pendulum scale. I could pendulum summon these, but, you know, really, what would be the point, you know? Like, there's really no point. I think I might just go ahead and take it slow. Like, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and take it slow and see what happens. Maybe one more card, because I could play you, Pendulum Summon you. I guess I could have just Pendulum Summon just to block me, though. Alright, Fortress, sure. So, uh, hmm, how to handle Fortress? I mean, I could go into, like, Ignister. Ignister! Um, anyway, you look at the title and you're like, what the fuck is that, Daniel? Alright, well, uh, I'm actually playing a new card game. I mean, it's not like I'm, you know, taking to the extreme, like, oh, well, guy's not doing my channel anymore, and, you know... Uh, no more Yu-Gi-Oh, of course not, but, uh, you know, me and my friends are just playing this new card game. Uh, you know, I'm not the biggest fan of Yu-Gi-Oh in real life. I really don't even have any Yu-Gi-Oh cards, so, uh, it's just a game that, you know, my friends just kind of picked up, and we're like, alright, well, let's go ahead and try this out. We got that Insta-Fusion Norton, that sacky-ass shit, you know, I mean, there's, there's some sacky-ass shit in the game that I'm playing, but it ain't Norton, I can tell you that. Uh, so, as you can tell by the title, it's called Weiss Schwartz. Uh, you, you might have heard of it. You might have heard of it. Um... It's kind of like an interesting anime game, it really is. Like, uh, me and my friends all picked up different decks. Uh, Renny has Sword Art. He didn't. He doesn't like Sword Art, but he's like, screw it, I'll take Sword Art because at least the anime I know. Uh, I got Attack on Titan. My friend Fonzo's got uh, Kill a Kill, and uh, you know, just animes. And you, and they're all played like like the game is the same, but they're just you know, it's kind of like. The animes are the archetypes, and it's just a really interesting premise, so I gotta keep on trying fucking Twin Twister. Like, oh my god, like, uh... I guess I'll go ahead and activate you, and then I can go ahead and Pendulum Summon you two, and I guess you, and then go into go into Nister. Oh wait, you're not even in my Pendulum Scale. See, I, I was kind of wondering that, I was like, I was like, my Pendulum Scales, I know my lower ones are like three, like, how do I summon my, you know, my, like, like my Lizard Draws and shit back, so... That is definitely going to be like the conundrum. So we'll go ahead and go into that powerful Ignister. And then I'll go ahead and summon me one for my deck because I can. <laughs> and go ahead and activate. Get rid of you. To spin back you. Non targeting, of course. And run over you. So despite the the not great start, I mean, I lost a nice majority of my life points. Uh, I'm just not sure how I feel about the, the Draco engine. Because while they're nice and scales and face off is good, uh, these, these threes, I don't have synergy with the rest of my decks. I have some twos, I have some threes that I would like to pendulum summon, but I don't think I could pendulum summon them under the Draco uh, ruler engine. So it kind of sucks. It might be best, literally, to just go with um, uh, with like the Magician engine, which has like a pendulum scale f lower to like one. So I can actually pendulum summon this, but I kind of wanted to incorporate a different engine than like the ninjas. You know, I kind of wanted to be a little bit different, but I guess you could say the same. Well, Zushin and freaking BES, they they both use the freaking Monarch engine, so you know, even though they're for definitely def different uh, uh, purposes. Wow, I'm gonna get hit with a motherfucking Dark Core. I mean, I was gonna lose anyway, clearly. I mean, just exceed those two and like Castell spin me, but motherfucking Dark Core, people. Motherfucking Dark Core. <laughs> so sad. It's so sad. I wish I would have opened up better. I just kept on drawing twin twisters. Two twin twisters for nothing. Like, hey, you know, fucking useless. Fucking useless. And I drew into one and drew into another one. It's like, it's like fucking why Pro decided to not even shuffle my fucking deck. Like, alright, alright. Alright, let's get another duel. There. So, uh, yeah. Uh, the deck, I must say, the game is much, 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 much cheaper than freaking Yu Gi Oh! I can definitely say that with. With with assurance that the deck it, uh, that the game is a lot cheaper, uh, I think like the most expensive card in my deck is like four dollars. You know, I mean, they, they, it's more of a collector's. Uh, some things are more of a collector's thing, definitely. Uh, they have like um, 
uh, like some special holographic cards that are you know signed with the the voice actor and all that and those cards can get pretty pricey but you know if you don't care about that stuff and you just want some common cards like you could pick them up for you know pennies on the dollar it's really cheap uh the game i'd say is fairly interesting when it comes to um how it's played how it's played a lot a lot more back and forth than Yu Gi Oh. i must say uh for one there's no back row so you know, there, there's kind of like honest cards, you know, they're, they're, they, you can counter your opponent, so they attack and you can play the card and increase your your attack. So it's kind of like honest S monster, so that's fine. But, you know, there's there's not like, alright, well I'm gonna go ahead and go first and then fucking, you know, set five on your ass, you know, there's, there's none of that. Uh, a lot of back and forth, you know. I create a field, fight your monsters, you create a field, fight my monsters, back and forth and back and forth, you know, there's a lot of that. And, it's it's fairly interesting. Uh, I guess I can just go into Leo. I'm kind of want to go into Odin, but there's just no point because I'm just gonna get cast out. At least this can't get cast out. And then, of course, those synchro materials go back to the extra deck, so that's pretty nice. So right there, the the Draco engine kind of worked because I was summoning fours. You know, like I said the pendulum skills. It's just like, hey, we're Draco, we're Dracos. We summon four. That's all we do. And if you try to do anything outside of our uh, outside of that, then we're not pendulum summoning that shit for you. <laughs> My first turn, Leo's pretty good. Uh, they're going against Dark Worlds? Ew. Ugh. Dark Worlds. Zen mains. Well, that, that target, so. <laughs> I, was, I was like, I was like, how can, how can you really handle me? Like, that, that's, a, that's a pretty good question. How, how can you really handle me? Uh, I guess I can go ahead and activate Pop and then do that play. It's just, you know, how am I supposed to get do with, deal with the Zen mains efficiently? Yeah. You know? Like, I don't have any tuners right now. It'd be nice if I had my horse or, you know, something like that and I had some tuners. Could go into, like, a C with the Castell, but, you know, that there goes two of my monsters right there, you know? That sucks. But I guess, I don't know, maybe I'm in a winning position that I'm, I'm fine to do that. I'm gonna hold off on the popping. Let's see if I see making Castell will be fine. I don't want I want I don't want to use these two for that, but it might be best just to go ahead and do this. But yeah, a lot of back and forth, you know. The games are much longer. There's a mulligan roll too. Yeah, mulligans are nice. <laughs> That'd be nice if Yu-Gi-Oh had had that sometimes, because uh, when you open up booty, you open up booty. But you know, in exchange for no mulligan roll in Yu-Gi-Oh, of course you do best two out of well, you generally do best two out of three. So when you do best two out of three, you have a higher chance of getting out of a shitty hand. While well, that game, just play one. Uh, round. I mean, we, we, as, a, as as collectively we decided that we were going to probably start doing uh, matches, just because it seems like matches will be more engaging, because you can still open up like shit. You can still get opening hand, mulligan, and then still draw like shit. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright. So, actually I should have Alright, you're gonna go ahead and banish to summon Malefic Cyber End. That's cute. So, I'm gonna say, are you gonna go ahead and activate your gates? And then once again, always set in main phase 2. So go ahead and banish. Then I will hit you with this, uh, Twin Twisters. Always set in main phase 2, people. That, that is that is the rule. Always set in main phase 2. You just lost your drag down for no reason. <laughs> just because you decided to set it in main phase 1. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> So, um, yeah, you banished your, uh, tour guide, and I guess that is game. Like, <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> like, ah, Twin Twister, she's so strong. <laughs> On, like, last duel, I was, like, sitting there, like, oh, uh, Twin Twister, I can't do shit with you. That, that, that time, I like, got, I decided to go ahead and set it that turn. Like, yep, set it. Set the Twin Twister. <laughs> Alright, so, that's another duel. Let's go ahead and get another one. Bear back. Alright. But, uh, yeah, it's just interesting, you know? Uh, it's really nice to play a game that's based on animes you like, you know? That, you know, I can have my Eren turn into a Titan and fight Renny's Kirito and Asuna from Sword Art. It's like, okay, okay, I see you. <laughs> I see you. Interesting concept. Okay. So, looks like some kind of Light Sworn Shadal deck. Okay. Well, um... You know that uh, Shadows don't get for cost, so that charge, that charge is definitely a cost. 
that wasn't the best of plays. Wow, Jane, you don't see you don't see Jane that often anymore. You do not see Jane that often anymore. It has been a cool minute since Jane has been played like that. So, okay, okay. So I can go ahead and uh, play Guitar Turtle, play Monkey Board, Guitar Turtle, get to draw Monkey Board, get to search, and uh, at least have my pendulum skills between. Uh, I guess that maybe I should do Lizard Draw just to go ahead and pop and draw. I mean, it's all really all the same. Pop, draw, search, draw. I think my opponent quit. Yeah, either they quit or or YGO Pro froze. Either or, yeah. Because I can't click on anything. So I think my opponent just kind of disconnected. Oh, no. It just had a hell of a delay. Like, what the fuck was that? <laughs> like, oh, calm your ass down. Fucking, uh, <laughs> uh YGO Pro? It's not even that serious. So we'll go ahead and search. Uh... Yeah, I guess we'll go ahead and get the Joker. There's not anything else that I'm a normal summon this turn. I don't have any tuners. Like, like where am I? Where's Where's my tuners? We have lots of turn, lots of tuners in here. There ain't no way to be found. Like, all right. Uh, I guess I can go ahead and get Sorcerer. Yep. Go ahead and get Sorcerer. Then uh, I guess I'll go ahead and Pendulum Summon and jump the living shit out of you. So, you, 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 and uh... yeah, you. Because your your effect's actually not that bad either. Summon you, summon you, summon you, and summon you. And yes. So I'll go ahead and crack you and you. And get pluses and get searches. You and you. Ah, so good. I'll just go into battle. Run you over, you only increase when you attack me. But uh, yeah, if you guys, I, I mean, I'm not gonna go ahead and do anything related content. I probably could, if you guys asked me to, I probably could. Just see like a random video of a, how the game, of a, like a match or something, like a, uh, a game. But uh, you know, you won't be seeing, you no, know, like you will mastery, like kind of different, like uh, I think Cyber Knight. I think Cyber Knight does something different. Um. I guess I could go ahead and turn these two into a, uh, into a Paladin. That wouldn't be terrible. I can only use the effect of Lizard Draw once per turn, so there's no point in doing that. So yeah, I could just turn, like, you two to a Paladin, get the search during the end phase. That's pretty power. And, uh, go ahead. And during the end phase, I guess I'll just go ahead and give me a luster. I mean, why not? If I pen up some of that luster, that's an ignister. And that's ignister, which is pretty power. <laughs> or, I, I think the tuner has to be the specific tuner. Yeah, the tuner has to be the specific tuner. I was like, is the tuner generic or anything generic? Like, no. <laughs> that would be nice, because it'd just be like, you three right here. It's like, you three right here, go ahead and uh, become a, a, a Nordic beast or one of the gods, but... I'm just kind of worried. I really want to summon one of the gods this uh, this video. I guess I could have, but I went into uh, into uh, Leo instead. It's really all good. It really is. All right. I'm gonna pitch that for us. Yep. Go ahead and summon the Raiden. It's it's light swords. It's skill is trash. It's like it's like the bare minimum scale. <laughs> ah, mill that BLS. Go into Michael. Banish him. Banish something. Like yeah. <laughs> Oh, black girl. Oh, that too. I might as well go ahead and play this. Get a search. Go ahead and search my uh, my tuner. That way I can actually go into one of the gods if I want to. So, say, so, hey, do you got enough light swords? Uh, yeah, you do. Yes, you do. Yep, there he is. Ah, JD. Ah, skill. <laughs> All right, and then Zephyros like put the JD back in your hand and then summon JD. Ah. Fucking, fucking skill is trash. Fucking skill is trash, man. Ah, two JDs! Two JDs! Alright, three JDs? I would say, you gonna fuck me up with three JDs? <laughs> oh my god, fucking skill is trash. Fucking light swords, man. That's not game, it's still have 400 left, but like, wow. 
that's probably one of the things actually I actually really like about one shorts is that there's no fucking FTKs, OTKs. Like, the games are nice and long and deliberate, you know? Uh, there's been plenty of times where I've got first turn, got the shit kicked out of me, but at least it wasn't game. And then even one of the matches, I even came back and uh, won despite getting the shit kicked out of me. So, <laughs> but yeah, this is gonna be, this is gonna be fun. I gotta deal with fucking two JDs and these level fours. I got the pendulum mechanic on my side, so I should be able to bust out miracles at least. Yep. Ah, uh, skillless trash. Mmm. The trash is so skillless. So much skill. Too much skill. Dude, I could literally just go into fucking, uh... Oh, wait a minute. I can't even pendulum someone right now. Like, <laughs> like I would literally have to get, like, a lower skill. Uh, that's not great. Because all I have is upper scales. Alright, so I guess I'll go ahead and activate you. Not activate you. Activate you. Then Guitar Turtle, draw me a card. Yep, there's a little scale. Pop you. Draw a card. Play you. And then all I have to do is Pendulum Summon exactly to make a... Uh, Odin, and you only have 14, it's just attack over that Blackwing Zephyros, I don't even have to worry about you going into like a, uh, into like a, uh, playing an Honest or anything along those lines, like, we're just, we're just golden. So, let's go ahead and summon all of this, because depends on the mechanic, it's just, mm mm, -mm good. <laughs> that, and that, and I guess we'll go ahead and go into, uh, Oh, I can only go into Thor. Thor is 30... Do I look 14, 21? Yeah, that's still game. That's still game. I was, I was kind of worried. I was like, oh shit, did I not like have game? Like, yeah, I have game. I have, I have still game. I have game. And I can just go into Ignister because why the fuck not? Because it's Ignister. So, yeah. Just attack. That's, what, 19? I did the math wrong. Yeah, that's 19. Just go ahead and attack you. Yep. Yep. Yeah, what? What? You didn't win? Skill is trash. Milk, milk, like in two turns and jump me with two JDs and shit. Like what? You didn't win? How? <laughs> All right, uh, I'll get another dual pair back. So I, uh, yeah, it, it's just the, the game. It's really, it's a lot. It's a lot of back and forth. It's like, oh well, I do big play and then I kill your monsters and you kill my monsters. Back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. I really like that. Especially with my deck, I really enjoy my deck. My deck is, uh, like I said, my deck is the Attack on Titan deck, so, I mean, I'll bust out that Titan Aaron, which is kind of funny, because I'll bust out Titan Aaron's, like, but 35 feet tall, and then fucking Renny will be playing his fucking Sword Art Online deck, summon, like, an Austin and kill my goddamn Titans. Like, alright, alright, so I guess I can just go ahead and summon her, and banish two to, uh, summon two tokens and go for, uh, what's-his-face? <laughs> I was like, what's-his-face? Uh, Odin, we'll go for Odin. Even though he'll probably get fucked up, we'll still go for Odin. Just cause, uh, why not? So I can make myself unaffected by spells and traps. It's cool. It's not like he has any, but I can do it. So these, these, these fucking gods are just so anticlimactic. <laughs> it's so anticlimactic. It's not even funny. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Alright, well, I lose. Cause this deck is ridiculously good. Like... I can't wait. I can't wait. I, th I definitely think that this deck is going to be, like, at least tier 1.5. Like, sure, Nui fucking zombies are just too ridiculous. Mizuki's too ridiculous. Unizombie's too ridiculous. Fucking, uh, yep, Twin Twist is new. You know, we're, me and Ronnie were talking about it. Enabler, like, like, fucking Forever Epic. Like, I wouldn't say that, you know, the wobble chain saying that is right, but the fucking enabling pit push pitch is fucking ridiculous. They should have said, like, banish the card. That would have been better. That would have been better. Because that, that enabling is just too strong. But, I mean, look at this setup, people. Like, look at this. You fucking share new sage, and you got that one card sync 8. Like, you don't even need Skull Servants. You don't even need fucking Skull Servants, man. You can misplay and still have plays. Just Mizuki summon that bat, go for, like, a fucking Scar right and blow my shit up. Like, nigga, you are fine. You're fine. You could risk the neg on the fucking Twin Twisters because you're going to send that Mizuki. You got that fucking sage to be a one card sync 8. Unizombie's too ridiculous. Like, it's just too much. Like... Over the, like, you, you, zombie shit used to be hit. Like, it used to be hit. And then over the years, it's like, oh, no one plays zombies. We'll just go ahead and release it. You can have triple Mizuki and shit. And now look at where, like, look at where we're at now. 
dude, you're, there's nothing oops about it. Just go ahead and sink eight. Veals, all right, doesn't matter. All right, hit me with the dark hole. That doesn't matter either. There's no oops. I can book a life. All right. Just kick the living shit out of me. I don't know why you're summoning that now, but all right. You can. Well, he can attack. He can attack though. He used uh, Unizombie. No, I'm, I would say. Then why the fuck did you summon Sage? All right. All right. <laughs> all right. So activate you. Activate you. You draw me a card. Okay. Uh, I don't like you in my Pendulum Scale, but I really don't have a choice. I could just Pendulum Summon these two, go into Ignister. And then run over your Sage before you tribute off, because I don't I don't like that. Like, why'd you do the fucking... Why'd you book a life for a fucking Churny Sage? I thought maybe you had a fucking, um... Like a set... Like a, uh... A set... Uh, sword. Like, I thought that last card in your hand was sword, but I guess not. Like, Alright. So, we'll go ahead and get rid of your beals. You don't need it. And then we'll just run over your sage. And then you will literally, uh... No Mizuki's in grave. Like, you might be in a little bit of shit, but you're still fine. I mean, I'm top decking too. You're still at least top decking your two cards, so... You get, like, a... Alright, I was thinking maybe, like, a Book of Life, but I was thinking, like, a Yuna Zombie, and you're good. But hey, I mean, <laughs> fucking disgusting ass zombies, man. <laughs> yep, so, here we go again, that one card sink eight. Or in your Skull Servant place. Like, okay. I thought you were going to send a Mizuki, then use Mizuki, revive. Oh, never mind, you have a Zoom Zoom Zombie in hand, so you're just going to sink eight now. What are you going to go into, though? Like, Scrap Dragon? Are you... I'm trying to think. Oh, no, you can go into this fucking Shiranui guy. 3,000 sink 8, so you're new and tack over my ass. That's what you're gonna do, right? Yep. 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 Called that. And this, of course, will go ahead and get a search. Like, look at this shit. Like, look at this shit. Ugh, so I literally need a top deck into, like, monkey board. <laughs> I know this is really the only way I can get out of this situation. I need a top deck into, like, monkey board. Sucks I only have one Ignister, too. 4,300. 4, mmm. Mmm, what you searching for? Yep, another Unizombie. Yep, yep, yep. Because Unizombie can send Mizuki to go into another Sync 8 play. It's just, it's too easy. It's too easy. <laughs> yep. So, you gonna give me that monkey board? No, that's not what I needed. This isn't fucking anything. Like this, this shit ain't anything. Setter, I guess. <laughs> Like, oh, wow. <laughs> I, I got a top deck. I, I tried to top deck. I tried to come back to it, but he's still, despite me exhausting his resources, I was like, oh, I might be able to come back to it. He's like, no, because I got the two cards in my hand to still go off. Like, even though I'm playing shittily, it's still good because we have triple Unizombie, triple Mizuki, and triple fucking uh, Sage. Like, I don't even give a shit about the Skull Servants. The Skull Servants ain't shit. You just kind of threw them in the fucking deck. Like, the deck is great without the fucking uh, the Skull Servants, but whatever. <laughs> What the fuck ever. Wow. Why the fuck would you do that? Wow. So wait a minute, wait a minute. You're telling me you fucking allured, miss, fucking messed up, but drew and pitched the Mizuki? That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair in this game. Like, wow. Wow. That was, that was bullshit. What is shit? Like, what the fuck? How do how do you summon a lure? Get it wrong. Miss drop his hand. Oh, but it was a Mizuki. Ah ah, please. Like all right, what? <laughs> that was bullshit. <laughs> all right, I feel like getting one more duel. We are back. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I still don't know how I feel about the Draco engine. Man, you can go into Nister more. Wow, I got it before my pals in this hand. Like all right, where's my fucking Nordics? <laughs> it just doesn't have synergy with the Nordics. Like it definitely has synergy with itself because you know. I mean, I mean, really, what what was Draco Pals but a rank four shenanigan deck, right? But uh, you know, I want to I want to Pedro summon some threes and shit. Oh my God, you're actually using you, Bell. I feel bad now. I really feel bad because I don't want you. To, I hate I hate that because I'm not playing you, Bell. Like it makes me feel bad. It really does. 
I'm so sorry. Like, you foolish, you value. Like, you gonna master me. He's definitely playing you. Like, no, if you knew my channel, you knew that I'm probably recording daily duels. Like, I'm generally not on Dev Pro unless I'm recording daily duels. So, yep. So, I guess I'll just go ahead and beat the crud out of you. Probably guessing this is a limit reverse, and even if it is, I mean, I can easily handle that. I could just go ahead and spin you. You bet with like a Castell or something, so. Uh, I feel bad. I always feel bad when someone faces me with you, Bell back. But no. Uh, so, I just wanted to kind of talk to you guys about that. I mean, my vacation, it's really not a vacation. The struggle's about to start. Um, I'm in college, but I'm at, uh, still community college, just uh, taking, like, classes I don't need to take. Really, you could call it a vacation, but really not, because I wasn't taking any major classes. I pretty much already graduated from community college, about to get my associate's degree. But, uh... Uh, definitely, uh, I mean, I'm retaking English 102 to get a better grade, and, uh, and then some practice preparation course. The practice is my teacher exam. I gotta take, uh, past that to get my teacher's license, so. Uh, outside of that, I'm not really anything, because I was waiting to start university, which starts today, Monday. Uh, so this is, I'm recording this Sunday night, just, <laughs> you know, trying to get everything out of the way before we just go ahead and, uh, jump right into things, because you already know that it is about to be some bullshittery. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's accelerated classes, I definitely know that, so uh, it's going to be lots and lots of, um, of just fun, <laughs> fun on the bun. Uh, instead of, uh, you know, colleges, I'd say, what, generally like three, four months, three, four months? Yeah, about the uh, Each class is a month long, so it's gonna be really accelerated. It's probably gonna be a butt ton of work. So that sounds like that sounds like fun. Uh, still don't have a tuner. I I'm I'm running the tuners, but I'm not drawing any tuners. So I mean, you, some of you, no, you, you. Opponent over here is falling asleep. I mean, I'm sorry, but this is just the way this deck is played. I mean, this is literally my first time playing uh, Pals. Uh, I'll go ahead and pop you, and I guess you. I get pluses. That's pretty much what's the, well, the reason why I went with this engine for the Nordics. It's just go plus. I have a ton of uh, non tuner materials for my synchros uh, for my monsters, but. So let's go ahead and bait out that uh that limit reverse or call of the haunted. Cause you, yeah, if it's like cause you wouldn't have foolish to bell if you didn't have it. Like like I no. Why the fuck would I want to crash into you bell? Let's go ahead and make Castell. It's too easy. So you wouldn't have foolish to bell if you didn't have some kind of block, so. so go away. Bye Felicia. I'm done, and I got hella pluses. Like, like, look at this shit, hella pluses. Like, I guess I'm gonna keep these pendant skills. I really would love to draw like a tuner or something. Like, you feel bad, but then you know, uh, I guess that's what you get for assuming that I'm playing you, on here, because I never said anything along those lines. Never said, yeah, definitely, definitely play uh, uh, you, <laughs> I never said nothing of the sort, now did I? <laughs> Uh, that's really nothing to do right now. I mean, besides just, like, go in. Who's in my extra deck? Oh, All right, he's just gonna go ahead and scoop it up. I don't blame you. Like, e e e I wonder what your background is by the end of the day. Not really. I don't care. <laughs> <coughs> so, uh, I'm not sure. I, I like I like the, the Performer Power Engine. Like, I like the, pl the, 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 the plus, you know? I mean, for goodness sakes, Guitar Turtle and Lizard Draw, like, ridiculous, you know? Just draw, pop, draw, you know? And then they're level 3 too, so I just need my tuners, let's go. But these, I'm not sure how I feel about them. They, they, they don't bring anything to the table. The other thing I was thinking about was trying out was the Dino Mist, because I know Dino, some people are doing the Dino Mist engine because, I mean, you get a, you get a fucking uh, searcher for your um, for your pendulum scales, like, you, you fucking go to town, you know? I'm gonna say, you got that Dino Mist charge, search that, and you search with this, and you just go plus and go ham. Coming some other Dynamis monsters. I was thinking about doing that, but then I'm just not sure of that either. 
So I think I'll go ahead and just like once again take out the Draco the Draco and just turn it back to probably just perform a Pound Nordics and then I said I just need some tuners like where the fuck are my tuners? <laughs> like what tuners am I running? Well the the problem is that there's a lot of the Nordic tuners that don't work well with the deck. You know I guess I could run that fat level five one to go for Loki but Loki's not good but. The horse, he's level four, and the level two, and the other level four that can be substitute for anything. She get only, the other materials have to be Nordic, so that sucks. Like, they, like the Nordic tunings are just so fucking nerdy. Like they're they're so restricted for how good their plays are. Like for goodness sake, you act like I'm dropping some fucking invincible ass monster. Like no, I'm dropping a fucking uh, fucking Nordic god that you can get rid of with Castell. Like all right, <laughs> you know. Like if I, if I had like a Quasar esque effect, then maybe we could talk, but no. Anyway, uh, I don't think we have much more time on this. I'd say maybe like one or two more weeks, so we're done with it. But for now, I mean, I'm just, I just want to try out the Draco Palace and tell you guys about why short. So, like I said, if you guys want to try it out, I mean, it's a fun little game. I, I, I don't mind it. You know, it's a fun little game to play with friends. I believe that when the locals have some, uh, some tournaments, but I'm not sure, you know. I'm not sure. I don't want to get sucked in, because I get sucked into shit really easily. So I'm kind of worried about that. So for right now, we're just playing with structure decks, like literally just trial deck, structure decks of the game. Uh, they have individual attacks and stuff like that, but still. So, uh, so I just want to tell you guys about that. So uh, I'm gonna be uh, going to university. This is my last day of freedom, pretty much. Uh, so I guess I'll be telling you guys about how that's going on Wednesday. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will uh, see you guys tomorrow playing the ninjas and uh, tag dueling with someone. I don't know yet. <laughs> Alright people, thanks for watching.